And it's been nine days since Election Day, and Nevada remains in the spotlight. Since then, several lawsuits over ballot counting and voter fraud have been the topic of discussion. 13 Action News reporter Alicia Patillo joins us now live from the Clark County Det uh, Election Department with the message to the GOP from state officials. Alicia. Good morning, Dave and Kalina. Attorney General Aaron Ford has been very vocal dismissing any allegations of voter fraud. And yesterday he spoke with other state officials uh, directly uh, addressing this issue. Take a listen. Good day, everyone, and welcome to today's Voter Protection Program press briefing. The Voter Protection Program is a line of communication for all to express concerns and ensure secure elections. As the GOP and Trump campaign continue to accuse Nevada of voter fraud and the counting of illegal ballots, Attorney General Aaron Ford says their claims uh, lack evidence and many are simply just not true. Ford says he has the most confidence in our county's election department and he says Nevada's election was, quote, free, fair, safe and secure. There's been no evidence of widespread fraud or any wrongdoing, and no PR stunt or piled on litigation from the Trump administration is going to change that fact. How do I know? Because they've tried to pile on litigation in our state four times that I've been involved in lawsuits that they filed here, and four times our office has won. The latest lawsuit that aimed to stop the counting of melon ballots was dismissed uh, this Tuesday of this week at the Republican Party and Trump's campaign's request. At the Republican Party and Trump's campaign's request. I'm sorry about that. It comes after the groups uh, tried to withdraw their appeal last week, saying a settlement had been reached. Back out here live outside uh, the Clark County Election Department, we are expecting to hear from Clark County Registrar Joe Gloria today, as today uh, is the deadline to count all votes here in Clark County. Alicia Patillo, 13 Action News.